What's up everybody, hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto and to uh, a new video about Dogecoin or just uh, Doge, that's the uh, abbreviation. I think you all know that, which um, today it's actually relatively bullish again. I saw that Shiba Inu was relatively bullish too. We hit a major resistance level with Dogecoin. So I thought it would be valuable to take a look at it again. As you can see on the chart, the resistance level we touched is this resistance level at around 7.5 cents. So that's obviously a big psychological resistance level. Uh, the entire resistance level ranges from 7.5 cents up to 8 cents. Um, so, so the main thing we're looking for with Dogecoin is to break above 8 cents. All right, so Bitcoin is still relatively bullish. As long as Bitcoin stays above 22,500, uh, as, as, as long as that's the case, I think Dogecoin still has the possibility to break above 8 cents and to get that move up to at least eight and a half cents, but we could even reach all the way up to uh, this level here at 9.1 cents, all right, depending on the market circumstances. So that's the main thing we would need to do, but for something like that to happen, I think, I mean, obviously if we get some, some news, I don't know, from Elon Musk or something, or just fundamental news about Dogecoin, obviously if that happens, uh, something like this is going to happen immediately. But if that doesn't happen, so if we have a relatively stable, neutral market, uh, what I think what would need to happen with Bitcoin would be a break of the uh, 24,000 level. So we're now, now we're kind of toying with that level, right? We're, we're trying to get there. Um, if we would really want to uh, get a move like this with Dogecoin to reach into or to tap into this area again, right here, if we want that, we would need Bitcoin about 24,000, I think. But because for now, I expect us to, um, you can see we, we took a little bit of re a rejection off of 7.5 cents, as I said. I think for now, we can actually take a take a break retest off of this level between 7.2 and 7 cents. And I think we can reach 8 cents, but I don't think we can break that. I think we'll drop down, um, back down again to do that 7 cents area and kind of consolidate on top of that, all right? Um, so I think something like this is possible, but some things would need to happen in the market for, for, for that to, to actually happen. Otherwise, I think that 7.5, 8 cents level is going to be the top. And that isn't necessarily bad compared to other cryptos. It's, 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 it would be a little bit low, I agree. But it's a strong level and it's the same levels uh, we reached uh, the, the beginning of May after the drop. So it does show that Dogecoin still has some strength, obviously. Uh, it's still in the top 10, so it, obviously it has strength. <clears throat> but yeah, something like this just seems more likely unless we get some sort of a relief rally. And uh, some sort of a relief rally would be signaled by Bitcoin breaking above 24,000 or at least trying to break above that, right? So at least keeping that bullish momentum going. Um, so yeah, I think for now, that's my analysis on Dogecoin. Pretty quick analysis. So if you do have any questions about it, if I miss anything, please let me know. But for now, I want to thank you all for watching and listening, and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.